candle. y'all were and all you are now and so forth. So take a trip back in time with me, won't you? As we explore uh, how each of you were. Uh, of course, first we'll travel back in time to the time of good old Robert Franklin Chamber Jr. He was a hit youngster back in his day. And uh, all that stuff. He, was, he fought in the war. He went to school. He hard, worked hard and stuff. Let's take a look inside his chateau and uh, see what describes him as him. He collects records. And he's got lots of them. He's got so many shells. He might call a record case. Yeah. Anyway, let's see. Yeah. He likes to uh, make models and he likes trains. This is his uh, train model set. Look, he's got a cute little tunnel. Yeah. And you know, just, he didn't have it back then, but he has it now. He likes to sit back and watch television. Like I say, he likes to build models. And here's a good model, a rocket. Yeah. He was a technical engineer over at uh, General Electric Company. He designed the controls for plastic molding machines, so without him, you couldn't have the plastic for, uh, say, the toy train here. Yes. He also uh, went around the world a bit. One place, he went to New York. See, there's the Statue of Liberty there. He also, uh, he was born in uh, Texas. That's why we have this little cactus here. Oh, um, there's a little ship in a bottle here. Because, you know, he did go around the world, at least by water. He was born at Cherokee in uh, Texas. Actually, he was, he was like 116th Cherokee. But that's why we have this totem pole here. This Chinese lion here. That's, uh, he was, he's, been, he's been to Korea for uh, war in World War II, I believe it was. And he got conduct medal of honor, which that's what this is right here. And you notice this is his shirt, his uh, blue tartan, same pattern as his uh, uh, regular shirt. That's what they called it in Animal Crossing. This pattern here for his umbrella is a composition of four trumpets, because uh, he likes music, of course. Of course, he likes to think, so when he's thinking, he, uh, he pays the bills on his uh, desk. And uh, nowadays, he uses a computer, but back in, de back in his old days, that a computer would have fill up a whole room. And it would be much bigger than a refrigerator. And everybody in the business loved computers. I love you, big computer. Which I could say the same thing for a radio. Back then in the 1930s, it was the size of a refrigerator. And everybody loved the radio as well. I love you, radio. And of course, when he does his uh, thinking, he... Uh, some, he likes to write them out. He may have had one before, but he doesn't have one now in chalk for it. You know what he's thinking about at this moment? Social studies. That's <laughs> just by default on the chalkboard. And of course, he likes to play games, so we have this little chess board here. And uh, he's a bit of an outdoors person as well. So here's a representation of our backyard. Or probably his backyard in a day. Anyway, we have uh, yeah, sprinklers watering the garden. We have a little pond. Hey, who's up for a burger? Who's up for a burger? Yeah. You can also look into our space with this telescope. Hmm. I see there's the uh, sun. I can't look directly into it because it's so bright. 
I turned it a little bit. Oh look, I see the moon. The moon. And of course, he uh, takes care of his uh, yard and flowers, so he usually likes to mow them on, mow them on, mow them on. And uh, when he can with uh, with his uh, girlfriend back in the day was Barbara. Yeah. Take her on a picnic. Yeah. Nice little picnic table. So now we go downstairs to another point, another good point in his uh, life. Good old Maze Pub. Yeah. Got everything. He uh, drank coffee around here and stuff. But most of the time around here, Maze Pub, he sang. Up here on the stage. Along with the uh, classic jazz music of the day. And of course, you know, in the pub, you always have a bartender. Hey, Barky! Let me have a uh, martini, will ya? I'm sorry, bud, but we have no martinis. Oh, okay, then just give me a kubuski. One beer! Coming up! <laughs> of course, you know, of course, you have a telephone to talk to uh, people. Of course, uh, yeah, back then, yeah, they had telephones. And of course, like I see, I've always been to good music, so... Here's a good example. Here, uh, let me get that to you again. That's a little tune I whipped up, uh, Sonic's theme song. That's, uh, that's a sound tune. Um, of course, uh, he also likes the uh, other classical instruments, such as a cello. He should, he should have hung around in a room that was mellow, then he wouldn't have liked a cello. But anyway, uh, that's pretty much the last uh, Bob Chandler. Of course, in the, in the hero business, he's also known as Flower Man. Because he saves flowers' lives more than humans. So now, let's time travel to another time. For, yeah, the time of Barbara Chandler. To which here she is. But of course, uh, naturally, she has brown hair, but since it's Animal Crossing, they gave me blue hair by default. But anyway, let's go into her house and see what her lifestyle is. Back in her childhood, they had a small house, but yeah, she had many brothers and sisters.